Making a marble generator to transform this material into this is quite fast and easy. Let me show you how. In order to create this marble generator, I have to split my process in actually three areas. The first area is the one that has the bigger line of cracks. The second area has smaller cracks and the third area has an even bigger size for them. Now, all of these cracks have exactly the same process. The only difference is that part one and two are being edited at the same time. So once you have your cells patterns, you want to use an edge detect to get these lines and then a directional warp with a clouds tool in its secondary input. Now then from the bigger tile, you're gonna get an edge detect, a flat fill and a flat fill to random color to get these values and combine it with a vector warp grayscale to break up the tiling of the lines on the background. Then we will mask this up a little bit with a subtract to reduce the intensity and blend them together using an add linear dodge. I'm using a really low value 0.44 and not going one on one in here. Now after that, I'm gonna be using a slow blur with the same map and an HQ blur in min mode. And I'll mask this several times to reduce a little bit intensity and use a levels to bring that up again to my liking. Once again, I'm gonna use a slow blur with a clouds two with a mean value to pull everything inside my cracks. Once I have done this, I'm gonna use an HQ blur and combine it with a non-uniform directional warp as we've seen in other videos. The reason for this is I want to create this kind of like shadowy effect that if I combine them together, I'm gonna to get that kind of fall off in my base color that I'm wanting to. Now for the final step, you just need to follow exactly what I just said, but with a bigger pattern. And by the end, you're gonna combine them together with an add linear dodge, giving you this result. As an extra, you can warp these cracks with another kind of pattern that is blurred and it's going to give you a more organic look to your cracks transforming your material from this to this if you want to see more learning content on material art help the algorithm notice by reposting this video till next time